So while Black Ops 4 Zombies and the Zombies community was literally drowning, there was a little light of hope and we're hearing that we're gonna be getting 15 more Zombies maps come to Black Ops 4. And this leak is definitely, you, you know what I mean, normally I like to say that don't let your dogs out, but this time I'm gonna let you know straight up that let your dogs out because this is gonna be another opportunity for Activision and Craig to make that big, big paper because we're talking about Season Pass 2, we're talking about DLC 5, or we're talking about another Knock Their Untotem Remaster Remaster come to Black Ops 4, you know what I'm saying, so let's just get right into the video. Now, as always, if you're new to the channel, like and subscribe. Uh, all of that helps out a ton and it is greatly appreciated because this leak is, uh, I, I can guarantee it that it's gonna happen because this leak is coming from from the same guy who is very patriotic this guy is up there this guy has a track record of being credible consistently not once not twice this guy has been out there this guy was very involved with this community this guy has been putting out consistent and credible leaks let me tell you and if you remember that time when everyone was getting disappointed by that HUD and everyone was watching those leak gameplay you know what I mean this guy was on top of his game this guy was leaking blood of the dead Easter egg steps and this guy was leaking right before the game even came out and this guy was also on top of that classified Easter egg ending cutscene this guy confirmed it before we even got it and I was kind of like in the very middle sometimes I would believe that there will be one sometimes I would be like nah I'm losing hope but this guy would literally Literally get PO'd every time someone would say there won't be an Easter egg ending cutscene in Classified because this guy knew that there will be one and we know that was true and recently he also confirmed the fact that we would get DLC 1 on this day. I mean whenever DLC 1 released this guy was on top of it. This guy said a week prior to the release date that we would be getting that DLC 1 and guess what we did and now finally after the zombies community has drowned this guy says and I quote not enough content. 15 more zombies maps coming to BO4, 3, 4 dots, I cannot see very well from distance, end quote. Now, how this is gonna go down, I guess right here we're gonna assume things. Number one, if you go into the Black Ops 4 zombies main menu, I guess you can pretty much see that there's a lot of space and I guess we can handle 20 maps. I mean, even uh, Black Ops 3 had built a system in a way where we could have got more maps and that was kind of like the main speculation of uh, DLC 5 back in those days if you remember where people would uh, try to fit in more maps I believe glitching queen was on top of that you know what I mean and we had other leaks now scenario number one DLC 2 is gonna be a nuketown zombies remake and it's gonna come out with the black ops pass so if you got the black ops pass pull up your pants get ready because this gonna get wild and then we're gonna get DLC 3 and DLC 4 so three maps right here and then we're maybe talking about season pass 2 so Activision is gonna make that big big paper maybe with that we're gonna get five maps maybe we're gonna get six maps maybe even more who knows and then we're talking about DLC 5 aka Zombies Chronicles 2.0 and with that we can literally see Call of the Dead remaster, Transit Die Rise and Buried remaster and I guess that will make people happy but if we get a season pass 2 and on top we get a nuketown zombies remake from the black ops pass which is very likely it's gonna happen so people are definitely gonna get salty but the second scenario i guess would be very good because we can expect dlc 2 to be a nuketown zombies remake then dlc 3 and dlc 4 so three maps right there and zombies chronicles 2.0 will cover call of the dead remaster transit buried and dyrus and maybe with that we're gonna see the previous zombies chronicles map where i'm talking about nuketown remaster getting remastered once again we rock remaster getting remaster once again you know what I mean so we're definitely gonna see the zombies chronicles 1.0 come to black ops 4 zombies I mean the zombies chronicles was literally made on the black ops 4 system I mean every map after the rise and the wrath was made on the black ops 4 system Zetsubu Nishima was the first one that they made and Jason Blundell even confirmed that so yeah on paper this sounds very exciting and I'm very excited for the future indeed but man knock the Antonio remaster coming to black ops 4 as a remaster I'm not sure about that one but this is just a guess because uh, zombies alert says that we're gonna get 15 more zombies maps and not 15 more new maps but let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below like and subscribe for more videos on the channel check out some other videos on the screen as well and i will see you in the next one